my name is Mary and welcome to my channel Mary Making Crafts. In today's video I have another Diamond Art Club sneak peek for you and I'm so excited about this one. It's so stinking cute and anybody who's anybody who knows me <laughs> knows that I am pretty much a crazy cat lady. Okay let's just be honest. I love kitty cats and when I was presented with the opportunity to show you guys this kit I absolutely, absolutely was overjoyed. So thank you to Diamond Art Club for sending me this. But this kit is called Cat's Rule. It is by Tom Wood. Now this is a new artist to me. I believe it's also a new artist to Diamond Art Club, but don't quote me on that one because I'm not 100% sure. So anyway, this one is a 55.8 by 73.7 centimeter kit or 22 by 29 inches. And it is called Cat's Rule. And as you can see here, we've got a little clubhouse that says no dogs allowed. We have cats rule and dogs drool. Now, let's be honest, I do still love dogs as well, but self-proclaimed cat lady at heart here. We have two little kitties at home, so this kit will be near and dear to my heart. I absolutely love it. So let's get into it, shall we? I gotta start on my plastic here. So this kit, while I'm opening, let me tell you, because it's very exciting. Um, this kit is one of 40 new releases this week, which is super exciting. Now, normally all the sneak peeks would come out on a Friday, but this video is airing on a Monday in the afternoon because there are 40 of these this week. So hopefully you've had a chance to watch this and decide if you want to purchase it for the anniversary release that's happening this week. Now that anniversary release for Diamond and Ruby members um, for Diamond Art Club's rewards program um, will be earlier than the general release. So that is something to take note. The general release will occur uh, at 9.30 in the morning Pacific time um, for general release on Saturday 6.3. But, but, and this is the exciting part, for Diamond and Ruby members, we will get an early, I say we, because I am, I spend a lot of money at Diamond Art Club. Um, <laughs> uh, Diamond and Ruby members will get an early access window on Friday night. So at 9 p.m. on Friday night, and that's 9 p.m. Pacific time, so midnight Eastern time, uh, we'll have an early release access window uh, for these 40 kits. So y'all better get excited because I'm really excited. I don't know about you, but I'm I'm stoked and I love it when Diamond Art Club does these huge releases. It's always just a ton of fun and everybody in the community gets really excited about it. So I'm excited. Anyway, so this is one of them. Again, it's called Cat's Rule. Here is your tiny sticker. Now you can use this for whatever you like. Um, some people use it in their logbook. I like to use it on my box um, just as another identifier of what is inside that box. So we've got that. And then of course we've got our dust cover bag with our drills and our canvas. And we'll take a look at that in a little bit. And we also have our toolkit. So let's go ahead and take a second and we'll take a look at what's inside here. All right, first up in our toolkit, we have our Diamond Art Club tray and stopper. So those drills stay right inside here. We've also got a little bag of baggies. You can use these to kit up or down your diamond painting for storage with your extra drills later if you'd like. We also have our Diamond Art Club wax. Just there's two pads of that, which is more than enough to complete a whole diamond painting. Don't forget, take your plastic off of there. Super cute little heart shaped container that you can use for whatever you like as well. We also have our pen. Now that pen wouldn't be complete without a comfort grip. Now you can single place with this end or we also have two multi-placers that come with this kit. These are the nice thin multi-placers, which are my favorite ones to use. Um, there's a four placer here and a seven. So you can stick those right on the other end of your pen and you can multi-place or single place, whatever you prefer. Now your pen and your squishy colors may differ from mine, but they always match each other, which I think is just the cutest little touch. We've also got some tweezers here. Now these are uh, Diamond Art Club branded tweezers and they always have uh, very, very nice sharp pointy edges here. So 
be careful with those and keep that cover on there if you can. Um, now these only come in kits with square diamond drills. So this one is a square drill kit, which is why you'll receive those tweezers. Next up, we have washi tape. If you're not sure how to use washi tape, I do have a video that I will link right up here. Um, just to give you some more detail, but you can use this on the edges of your painting to cover up that excess glue. You can also use it to section off your painting. So whatever you would like to do there. And then we also have what we call a cover minder. So this one is a cute little, little half cookie. Those little French cookies that sometimes people call them macaroons and macarons. And I don't really know how to pronounce it. So I'm sure every single time I get one of these, you guys are like, Mary, that's not how you say it. So I, I don't know, um, <laughs> but it's a cookie and it's so cute and I don't have this color yet, so I'm excited. But you have two magnets on the other side of this little guy and uh, you separate one of them off and put it underneath your canvas. If you peel your plastic back, you can have the two magnets meet and it will hold the cover back for you while you're diamond painting. So cute, I love it. Anyway, there are all the contents of your toolkit. I'm gonna get this cleaned up and we'll take a look at that canvas here in just a second. So next up, let's take a look at what's inside our dust cover bag. It's really nice because it keeps your canvas protected. There we go. Go ahead and pull this out. So excited to see this one. But first, let's take a look at what's inside our canvas. So we've got our bag of drills. Just something to note here that this does have this labeled here. So if you decide to store your canvas and your drills separately, you can absolutely do that because it'll tell you which one this one belongs to. We also have our insert, a thank you for your purchase, instructions on how to diamond paint and your um, what's included in your kit along with uh, an invitation to join the VIP Facebook group. That is a really fun place to go to see what people in the community are up to. Um, tips and tricks, also some codes to go to the app for iPhone or Android, and you get 20% off your first purchase if you purchase through the app. Um, definitely highly recommend that because uh, why not? Well, <laughs> and also if you uh, don't, if you have the app, you'll get like notifications when new stuff releases too. Um, and it's definitely worth it because you find out about things ahead of time. Along with uh, access to the VIP Facebook group, you can vote for upcoming releases. Like it's just a lot of fun. So very highly recommend joining that community. Um, if you've never purchased from Diamond Art Club before, just an FYI, no obligation there. But if you've never purchased from Diamond Art Club before, I am an affiliate and I do have a code. Uh, it's Mary, M-E-R-R-Y 10, and it will save you uh, $10 off your first purchase. So Again, no obligation to use that, but it's there if you need it. Um, so we also have this little insert here as well. This is a nice little logbook sticker where you've got a start and end date option there that you can use to record from. Um, we've also got a larger image of that artwork. How cute is that? I love it so much. Anyway, <laughs> so this kit is uh, 54 colors. So if you take a look, you kind of... You can kind of see some patterns happening here, but let's start right here. So if you take a look here, any number under the number 150 is gonna be a uh, an AB drill, meaning Aurora Borealis. So it kind of just has like an extra iridescent coating on it. So it reflects the light a little bit differently and, uh, and, and the colors around it, right? So we've got two of those, uh, looks like a red and a green um, AB drill. And then you'll notice some other special numbers here and that's right here. So these two numbers start with a Z and I believe if I'm not mistaken, now don't quote me on it because I could, I could very well be wrong. Um, <laughs> I've been known to be wrong from time to time, but I'm fairly certain on this one. Um, so these two are actually fairy dust drills. And what that means is that they've kind of got like a little layer of almost glitter, but like a fairy dust type of glitter. And we'll show you what we mean there um, when I get to those drills. We'll definitely take a special look at these two Z's, the 3856 and 3865. So 
Anyway, we've got 54 colors here. Here are all the symbols. And these stickers, what's really nice is that they are individual. So you can absolutely use these to kit your diamond painting up and have all of your drills labeled. So that is also really nice. Definitely don't lose this bad boy. Anyway, um, so now that we've taken a look at these inserts, let's go ahead and we will take a look at all of our drills and then we'll do our big canvas reveal. Okay, so first up for our drills, we have 402, 37, 76, 38, 60. We have three bags, 310, that's gonna be our black color. 38, 41, two bags of that. Next up, we've got 938, Z3856. Now this is gonna be one of our fairy dust drills, and I'm hoping that I can show you what I mean by that, because it's a little tough to see on the camera here. Definitely see it with my eye, but with the camera, I'm hoping. There we go. You can kind of see it on these two drills by my nail right here, that there is just a little extra glitter on those drills, and they really pop. They're so, so cute. I love them. So there is our first one. It's a lovely cream color. I think you'll be able to see the fairy dust better on the other color, so give it just a second. We'll get there. We've got two bags of 895, super dark green, and then two bags of really pretty green, 3818. Next up, two bags of 3371, 300, 317, 400, and 301. We have two little lonely ones here, 3799 and 334. And next up, we have our other fairy dust drill. So let's take a look at this one. Hopefully you can, yes, you can definitely see it a lot better on this color. Um, so this is a really pretty, just off white, 3865 with a Z in front. And see that little coating on there? It is so pretty. It really is like a little fairy dusting of glitter. And it's, I love it so much. Anyway, we've got 898 and two bags of 498 a bag of 451, and two bags of 3024. 414, 902, 453, 3826, 413, and 937. 3861, 3755, and here is our first AB drill. That's our Aurora Borealis, and you can see that iridescent coating on that number 108. We have 3325, 890, super dark green, 775, and 319. Lots of really pretty dark greens in this one. I love it. Next up, getting into some of our smaller bags, we've got 3803, 758, 915, 920, 3721, 3731, 815, 918, 3770, and 471. And for our final bit of drills here, 931, 712, 322, 977, 976. We have 115, there's our other AB, our red. 739, 318, 452, and 779. So here you have all of them just kind of laid out for you so you can kind of see the whole color palette. Um, you know, definitely strong on those nice, rich jewel tones, which I love. Um, you know, the earthy browns and greens and blues. Love it. Um, and I'm really excited about those fairy dust drills. I just think they are so, so cute. I mean, what's not to love about them? They're adorable. Um, anyway, let me get this cleaned up. We, I will pick out all of our special drills and I will show you where they go on the canvas after the canvas reveal. So just before we get into our canvas reveal, I just want to show you the back of this canvas. Uh, beautiful, nice velvety uh, structure here. We've got uh, surged and scalloped edges to prevent fraying. Um, also, just so you're aware, on the bottom of this artwork, you're going to have your licensing information. Um, just showing that Diamond Art Club is fairly compensating artists for the use of this artwork. And I love that. Um, you also have, of course, your um, legend on the bottom right and top left of every canvas. So are we ready to see this one? It's going to be so cute. Look how sweet 
<laughs> I love it so much. So give me just a second here. Let me get you a slightly better view. Hopefully we can get most of it in the frame. Okay, there we go. A little bit better there. Now we've got most of the painting in the frame. Look how sweet. Ugh, I love our little grouchy kitty cat kind of saying cats rule, dogs rule. This is the clubhouse. There are no dogs allowed and all the kitties are up in a tree in a tree house. It's just so sweet. I love it. Um, I find it very interesting that most of these cats are orange. Um, I do have an orange boy myself, so I love a good orange kitty cat. <laughs> so cute. Anyway, um, let's take a look at those special drills. I'm going to go ahead and pull those out and we'll try to take a look at where they go on the canvas. Now, mind you, this is about as far up as I can reach where I'm sitting. So it's a little tough to get all the way to the top, but I'll do my best to point at where I see um, everything on the canvas. But also just to show you, I always try to come up a little closer here and just show you how beautiful this canvas looks. So you've got your poured glue. It is so shiny and perfect, nice and super sticky. Um, and all of those symbols are just so beautifully and clearly printed. Uh, so I really also love that. It is so nice. So let me take a look at this canvas. I'll take a look at where all the special drills go. And we'll look at that here in just a sec. I know that I say this all the time, but I just had to share before we get into looking at these special drills. Um, Diamond Art Club's placement of special drills is always so intuitively done and I just I really adore that about them um, I feel like you know they're not just kind of placed willy-nilly around the canvas they're really placed in thoughtful spots and and they're chosen thoughtfully and I, I love that anyway so I have to share with you where these are because they're so they're exactly where I would have wanted them and I love that so uh, first up, we have the symbol number one on our canvas. So we've got our two ABs. This is number one and number two. Um, we've got our green AB and then our red. So our green AB is exactly where you'd think it'd be. Um, and one thing that Diamond Art Club does often with a green AB is highlight places in like trees where sunlight is hitting them. And that's exactly what's happening here. So we've got sunlight a lot um, down in our bottom portion here. So I was showing you like this tree before and you could definitely see a bunch of ones in there. So anywhere where you see this light green, super light green color, that is where you've got that, that white or, or that white, oh my goodness, that green AB. So um, it is really accentuating even some trees up here in this uh, forest like not for us, in the tree behind the clubhouse. Um, and then a lot of them down here on the bottom. So that is where our green AB lives. I'll just set that there. Then we have our red AB. Now there's clearly plenty of red here in this painting, but the red is accentuating um, the painted cats rule dog stroll on this um on the sign here also where it says clubhouse up at the top it's accentuating that and then also just some brighter spots in the clubhouse itself it's also accentuating like right here along this window and over here along the trim as well so that is where your red ab is and then we've got our two fairy dust again just kind of highlighting that fairy dust. I'm hoping you can kind of see it there. It's very, very faint on this one, but it's so cute. So these fairy dust drills are really sprinkled all throughout our orange kitties. So, um, or our cream colored kitties, whichever. So this is this symbol. Um, it's like an arrow down symbol and it is really found throughout all of the cats. I see it in all of the cats that are this color. So, I'll put that here because it's, it's a lot like on the breastplate of this cat. There's a lot of it. Um, but then we've got our kind of our off white or, or mostly white um, uh, fairy dust. And this one, this one is a little speck of light in all of our kitty's eyes or most of them. Most of the larger cats where you can kind of See their eyes are a little more detailed. There's one little speck of this in their eyes. And then this also makes up um, just some detailing on the trim up here along here. 
but it also makes up most of this clubhouse no dogs allowed sign up top. So I thought that, that was really cool. So I just kind of chucked it up there. But anyway, so now you can kind of see where all those special drills go. And I'm in love. <laughs> I love this painting so much. It just, it kind of exudes summer to me, which I love. Um, and it's kind of a must for any cat lover. Um, I, I do have one little special. I would love to show you where I'm filming. And I usually don't do that. I usually just show you the floor. But I have to show you, if you're a cat fan, I'm assuming you're a cat fan if you're watching this sneak peek. And I just have to show you my sweet boy who happens to be sleeping on a bed that we purchased for him. So I am actually filming here in a spare bedroom. Um, and, you know, I just make sure the floor is nice and clean. And I film here because it's easy and it's quiet and it's just kind of a little tucked away spot, you know? Anyway, um, so I have... We have two cats, Pumpkin, who's my orange boy, and Spice, who is a brown tabby. And Spice loves anything cuddly. He's the cuddliest cat in the world. And let me just show you what I have been enjoying the whole time I've been filming. I mean, how sweet is he? Spice. Oh, goodness. He, I don't know if you heard that on the video, but he did do a little... Um, I adore that cat. He is so sweet. And I just had to share with you that we purchased this cute little couch for him. Because how cute is that? Anyway, <laughs> back to the painting. Uh, you will have to let me know if you plan on picking this one up because it is just so sweet and I love it so much. And I mean, cats roll. They really do. Anyway, um, I hope you get everything that you are hoping for in this week's release. Um, and if not, live vicariously uh, through those that do. But uh, again, just a quick reminder, 9 p.m. Pacific time on Friday, June 2nd is the Diamond and Ruby release of these 40 anniversary kits this week. And then on Saturday at 9.30 a.m. is the general release on Saturday, June 6th, 9.30 a.m. Pacific time. So that's 12.30 p.m. Eastern. You catch the drift. Anyway, I really hope you have a really wonderful week. Um, and I will see you in the next one. If you haven't already, please give this video a thumbs up. And I would love it if you'd subscribe and hang out with me for a while. And I will see you next time. Bye.